Hey everyone, so today I'm coming at you a little rough, but that's because I'm cleaning my makeup brushes today and I wanted to share with you guys how I wash them. Now, I do use a couple of like, well, just basically one random product that I think a lot of people don't use, maybe one or two when I think about it. Besides that, I mean, this is how I wash my makeup brushes. This is what works for me. I typically try to wash my brushes like a deep cleanse every two weeks. It really should be one week, but I just don't have the time. Let me just be honest. So um, in between time, I may just take like a makeup wipe and just like wipe in between. But even, you know, I'm not even gonna lie to you, sometimes I don't even do that. But I do try to deep clean my brushes every two weeks. I try to keep that schedule. I try to stay on that regimen because I do have acne prone skin. I do break out, I have sensitive skin. My skin is just all over the place. So yeah, this is basically how I wash my makeup brushes. I will have all the products listed in the um, info box, description box, sorry. And I'll also have it posted on my blog, lifewithchat.com. So yeah, just stick around and you can just see how I wash my makeup brushes. Thanks guys, see you next time. Okay guys, so I told you it's gonna be kind of weird, but I like to use the Dawn Ultra Platinum because it breaks down the makeup and the makeup brushes. I saw this on Pinterest, so I was just like, wow, why not? And it works really, really well. I like it. My Beauty Blender, I like to use the Beauty Blender Cleanser because it just, the properties in it just work so well to break down the makeup in the Beauty Blender and also remove all that bacteria. And I also like to use this on my makeup brushes as well. So I found this little guy on Wish.com. It's a brush egg, and the ripples on there are basically there to rub your brush across gently to also break down some of the makeup. I like to use a jar to do pre-soaking for my brushes to make it a little bit easier and faster to clean as well. So I just use an old candle holder. And lastly, you'll just need some dirty makeup brushes. When it comes to the pre-soak, I like to put about two quarters amount of detergent into the jar and follow up with some hot water and add my brushes and let them sit in there for about one to three minutes before I start the process of washing the brushes. Okay, so I like to start off with some warm running water and I'm gonna start off cleaning my Beauty Blender. And I like to run any water for a couple of minutes just to make sure that it gets nice and wet, go ahead and do like a pre-rinse. Going in with that Beauty Blender soap, I go ahead and try to take the Beauty Blender, rub it in there, and go ahead and start mixing it in with the soap and Running it under the water, rinsing out, making sure it's all nice and clean. I mean, it's pretty much self-explanatory, but I try to get the camera angles together. And as you can see, my Beauty Blender is filthy. I pretty much use this thing like every day and it kind of takes me a little minute to clean it, but I absolutely love the results from this product. And now we have a perfectly clean Beauty Blender. Moving on to the brushes, I like to just take the brush out of that pre-soak solution that I created earlier, rinse it underneath the water. Depending on how dirty my brush is, I'll use the Beauty Blender soap or I'll use the Dawn. And I'm just gonna put my two fingers, there's like a little slot for you to put your fingers into the brush egg. And I'm just gonna rub it across gently. As you can see, I'm moving it so aggressively, but you're supposed to move gently, guys. Do not do what I just did, because that was a bad idea. But anyway, yes, you wanna just rinse it off. Rinse out your brush. You wanna make sure you rinse it thoroughly because you can get bacteria in brushes. You get bacteria in your brushes, you put it on your face. It's just a nasty process. But yeah, what I'm doing now, I know you can't see, but I'm slowly and gently, just nicely, pushing the water out of the brush, like wringing it out. And then I also like to rub across my wrist to get the excess water out. And after that, I just put it on the towel. I make sure I reshape my brushes pretty much back to its original shape. And I just let it dry overnight.
I do want to mention guys too that if you do not have a brush egg that's totally fine you can always use the palm of your hand I used to use that sometimes I still do if I'm in a quick rush but if I'm gonna do like a super deep cleanse like I was doing today then I usually typically go for the brush egg only because I feel like it cleans the brushes a little bit better and plus I don't have to use my hand So that's it. We have all of our makeup brushes nice and clean for the week. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them below. What are some of the products that you guys use when you wash your makeup brushes? Let me know in the comments below. And until next time, I will see you then.